Good Saturday morning to you folks. Hopefully things are going well with you and uh, you had a good night's rest and you're ready to face the day. Um, I know I'll be uh, speaking at a, at a funeral service today and I pray for that family that God will just bless them and encourage them and give them help uh, and strength today. I'm going to read to you from Psalm 91 today. Psalm 91 says, He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God. In Him will I trust. Surely He shall deliver thee from the snare of the fowler and from the noisome pestilence. He shall cover thee with His feathers, and under His wings shall thou trust His truth shall be thy shield and buckler. Thou shalt not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the arrow that flieth by day, nor for the pestilence that walketh in darkness, nor for the destruction that wasteth at noonday. A thousand shall fall at thy side, and ten thousand at thy right hand, but it shall not come nigh thee. Only with thine eyes shalt thou behold and see the reward of the wicked. I'm going to stop there and just look at this piece of scripture for a minute that says, I will dwell in the secret place, or he that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, he is my refuge and my fortress, my God. In him will I trust. You know, uh, in this life, there are a lot of things that people turn to when they are in trouble. Now, I know there's a radio station I listen to out of Cincinnati sometimes, and and it's and uh, I think one of the commercials says, "If you've been stopped by the man, uh, call the man." And it's talking about a lawyer. If you've been stopped uh, by the police, call the lawyer. If you need help in getting yourself out of trouble. Um, <laughs> uh, I, we turn to a lot of different things when we're in trouble. Some people turn to uh, turn to alcohol. Some people turn to drugs. Some people turn to all kinds of things in the, this life that they think will bring them some kind of a relief, maybe. Um, but that scripture says that uh, the writer of that scripture, of that psalm, um, for sure says that he will turn to the Lord, his God. For that's where he will find shelter. God is his refuge. It says the Lord is his God. Uh, in him will he trust. I think it's very important for us to know that if we're going to look for something to trust in, we need to trust in the very maker of the universe who gives us um, this blessing of life that we live in the first place. Now, he can look down and see things that if they're going to be great or if they're going to be uh, disastrous, he can see those things in our lives uh, out in the future because he is there already. He is omnipresent. That means he's everywhere and all the time. We aren't there yet. We know what happened in the past. We could say, wow, I wish I had that to do over again. Well, he saw that and what it would be as well so no matter what you feel or think today know that he is always there he's always there with you he's always there for you he can be a shelter for you if you will accept that and you will allow him to this song says where could i go where could i go well like i said people turn to a lot of different things the writer of that song says he turned to the lord so uh, you may today consider uh, where you will go and uh, who you will seek help from and my prayer is that of course it is the lord living below in this old sinful world hardly a comfort can afford strive Face temptation sore. Where could I go but to the Lord? Where could I go? Oh, where could I go? Seeking a refuge for. 
for my soul Needing a friend to save me in the end Where could I go but to the Lord Neighbors are kind, I love them we get along in sweet accord But when my soul needs manna from above Where could I go but to the Lord? Where could I go? Oh, where could I go? Seeking a refuge for my soul Needing a friend to save me in the end Where could I go but to the Lord? Life here is grand with friends I love so dear Comfort I get from God's own word Yet when I face the chilling hands of death Where could I go but to the Lord? Where could I go? Oh, where could I go? Seeking a refuge for my soul Needing a friend to save me in the end Where could I go but to the Lord? Lord, I thank you for the day you've given us, Lord, and I thank you for the opportunity to be able to call out upon you in a time of trouble, Lord, but also to be able to just talk to you in a time when it seems like things are going well or fairly well uh, in our lives, Lord. I pray for all those that watch this today, all those that listen to this, and uh, many have said that they watch it daily or weekly at least. God, I pray that you would give encouragement and strength to them today. We love you, Lord, and we thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, folks, as uh, we say, uh, if you watch tomorrow, you know um, that we will be having service. So if you tune in here, uh, you will see Charity Free Will Baptist. We start revival. Uh, I'll be preaching tomorrow morning. Uh, Jeremiah Lewis will be preaching tomorrow evening. And then Danny Campbell starts a meeting. He and Raymond Lewis start on Monday night. We'll have special singing and, and uh and special preaching so if you're interested in watching our service you can do that on youtube or facebook either one we do go live at that time but you can also go back it's logged you can go back and watch it anytime you want god bless you all and we'll see you monday